Welcome back loyal subjects of funk and things are going pretty insane here. Um, the enemy's moved his general up though to absorb the missile fire so I'm hoping I can get some good shots off. Um, this is... it's not good. It's not going as well as I hoped. We're losing quite a few men here. Look at that, he hasn't lost a single one yet. Isn't that fucking stupid? It's just fucking stupid. Hasn't lost a single unit yet. And we're losing men left, right and centre. You can see the thing going down there. Uh, right. Might as well move these guys up a little bit. But we'll slow march. Oh my god, we're losing a lot of troops and he has lost three men from his bodyguard unit. There's the general himself. It's really upsetting actually. Right, these are now out of ammunition. So we can pull them out. Or we can use them as a, a shield of meat. Uh, I mean we do have superiority in a uh, way of infantry. I just don't know. Pull them back. How many men did they lose in total? Five. So we we pelted them and they lost five men with all those <laughs> ammunition. Which sounds about right. How much cavalry did they lose? Right, they lost half of the cavalry in that unit. This is just fucking stupid though. Oh well. These must now be out of uh, ammunition, I'd like to think. Right, well, we might as well, unless these lot are firing at us, which they do not seem to be, we might as well bring these out. Which is good, we've absorbed a, a good amount of their missile abilities. <laughs> Sounds about right. Let's get these on a uh, flaming round. We'll try and expel some of them missiles. There's no point in getting them in danger. All oh, right. Oh, this is good. Because if we can get some good hits here, you never know. What's he's doing? We need some good fortune here. Come on, bring give, bring some hits down for fuck's sake. Barrage, quick load, fatigue. Might as well switch that on. We need something for accuracy though, that's the thing. In fact, what we need to do is, is bring this guy here, but don't force march yourself, big man. You don't do it either. This guy can go at the end because they're blooming good, them, but we need to conserve them. In fact, we might want to put that there. It's the best we can do. Oh, come on! Not even a single fucking hit. Unbelievable. Just go standard. Ammunition should be more. Uh, you would have thought this one would have. Nah. I would have thought that one would have put the range up just having standard ammunition, but whatever. Not the range, the uh, accuracy. Come on! I'm just asking you to put one dirty hit there. Imagine if it hit the general. Come on, give us some fortune. We need it in this campaign. Oh, fuck off. There's two dead. Uh, 
these have was this frenzy. And we'll now start these off on a a long campaign. Get these out of Phalanx so they've got more defence for now. Oh! Fucking hell, I can't believe they've decided to do this. Okay, get ready with this. Oh shit! Right, get them in the mix. I don't know what to do. Well, fuck this up, guys, real bad. Where's my leader? Fucking hell, we've fucked this up so bad. We are so screwed. We are so fucking screwed here. Um, go on, get in there. Please get in there. Oh fuck, we're screwed. Oh. We are screwed. We've fucked this up so bad again. Oh, I hit. Oh. How the fuck has this happened? Bastards. It's just going to be any second now, my general will die. The men are broken and running for their lives. Excellent. Oh my god. Our general has fallen. Fucking classic, isn't it? It's always our general that falls, not theirs. Every single fucking time. <sighs> Why do I do this? Why the fuck do I do this to myself? Every time. Right, well, you might as well get out of there. Yeah. I'm just, I'm just fucking pissed off with this game. Why is it always my general who falls? He charged forward with his fucking general who were pelting full of fucking arrows for the last hour. And it's my general drops and dies, doesn't he? My general. Not theirs. Mine. Always mine. And now I get another general who doesn't have any integrity bonus. Fucking fan dabby dozy. <sighs> right, come on. Um, administrator or scholar? Oh, it's fucking froze. Oh, I don't know which one I chose there. The hell? I thought he died. Oh, right, so even though we're putting force march on, we can't move. So we're screwed there as well. Alright, okay. <laughs> it's not gonna get him there. <laughs> they must have lost a few troops there, though. They wouldn't be able to attack, I'd imagine. Um, he's going to attack it though, isn't he? It's in force march, which means we don't get any reinforcements. <laughs> what have I just done? I'm a fucking idiot. Right, let's take care of um, this stack, perhaps. Right, so we got as many troops as we could there. Maybe we should move back to... Verona. Now get that off Force March. If we move to Verona, then they'll have to, they'll have to attack us somewhere. Let's have a look. 
We have a nice garrison of cohorts and stuff. Let's have a look at the. Um, can we scout the? What's that there? Consumption. Settlement. Right. Okay. Building browser. I forgot how to do it. There's a way. No, I'm gonna go over Verona. Oh, that does that does have a nice garrison. That really does. Um, how do we have a look at the actual? There's a way you can scout the settlement. This is stupid. There was a way you can scout the settlement and have a look at it. Am I missing something here? Am I missing something? Okay, I'm going to move him back here. Because that means that this... These fuckers. Which are the... Who are they? War-hungry Rizigoths. They were clearly going to sack Rome. Not good at all. And these lot... Did he lose any troops here? They do lose troops here. Um, Not good at all. Again. I have to say. And there's no way we can actually look at this settlement. Usually there's a an option. Which allows you to scout the settlement. Unless you use a lot of like screaming at the, the screen. Saying it's there. It's there. It's there. I can't actually see it. I'm sure there was a way you could scout the settlement's surroundings. It's fucking weird. Right, okay, well, I can't see any reason to do anything else this turn. There's this guy that needs sorted out. And we're going to lose that stack in Spain. Which is going to be about right. Um, let's have a look. Public order. Yeah, we'll get the public order one. How's it going here in terms of happiness? 20? Does that mean there's a rebellion somewhere? Oh. Right. He's going to attack Tingis next turn. Right, what I'm going to do is... I'm going to send this fucker... Let's have a look at these. Integrity's still okay to Carfago. Which now has plus 4. Seracusa's minus 16. That's building troops. It's also losing troops because it's starving. And we'll then turn. How can I serve the people of Rome? Decimate the fucking Ready legion. And we've got this one here. Which... If I'm right... If I am right... We should be able to, in theory... To finish that one off. Um, yeah, they have mangonels, so I'm gonna go. Lost a unit of spears there. Um, right, okay, let's have a think about this. Let's give him an upgrade. Integrity 2. So we're getting integrity plus four now. Hopefully this will be the one that finishes that rebellion off. And if I'm right. Oh my god, we lost more troops. <sighs> oh well, maybe the less troops we have, the less chance we have of starving. Ready for orders. We'll bring this guy back down to Oh, I like how some of them are absolutely raised to the ground. Don't know who did that. It must have been a, oh, a Western Roman thing. Okay, we'll bring you back to the... The integrity is now at least going up. But still doesn't bode well for the, the king. Um, Maybe we should declare war on these fuckers. And they visit the Visigoths. Because they're going to go out of war with us soon. There was the Visigoths. Visigoths. Well met, friend. 
Declare war. Britain's joined me, so I'm hoping they'll attack Verona. I don't think this spot had a, a good. Oh, it does have a good garrison. In fact, ooh, let's have a quick look at this. Well, we only have one aid of one garrison. Right, okay. What we got here? We got Gothic levies. We got one, two. Who has missile superiority here? We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. But they have one, two, three, four, five, and an Onaga. Um, we have mass migrant morale plus one. What have we got? I don't want to fight this on the map because, as you've noticed, I'm not very good at actually fighting anything other than defensive battles. So, a balanced stance, units will receive no bonuses, no penalties. A protective, when you have missile superiority, they have onagers. So I'm not going to do that, I'm going to do a balanced stance. They beat me. Close defeat. Regroup and fall back! Right, okay, so, with that all being said and done, we will then put ourselves inside Jemina, where we can use the full garrison to its potential. Um, they've lost a lot of troops there, mind you, so if they decide to either settle down or attack this, they're going to lose. Or if they attack that, we get a chance to try and take down some of their troops. But we'll just have to see. Depends what these are all going to do. It really does depend on a lot of things. Right, let's end turn. At your command. This one is going up, so we're all right there. Um, I'm just going to end turn. See what happens. This is it, because I hate end and turn. It's so, such a monumental thing. But we'll see. We're going to have a lot to do here. I'd imagine we've got those three legions in France which are now grouped together in an area in which has a lot of prosperity, which is good. So they're all healing. There you go. Just as I thought. It made more sense. Mm. Light marines, skirmishers, marines. So I'm going to fight this on the battle, on the map, I think, and hope that these lot can come and help out in some way. <sighs> Next turn, and we can remove them from the game. We had to declare war on them though, because they were only going to go towards Rome and then sack it. They were never going to be nice to us. They've lost a lot of troops there, mind. Probably more troops than they would have if I fought the battle on the map. I'm better at defences, mind you. But, um, yeah. Let's just hope we can pin some of these down for a good amount of time. If we can get these boats landed, there's three of them, we can hold them back for as long as possible. But we'll just have to see about that, won't we? Damn it, we're in a tight spot. We should have won in Spain, but we didn't. We're going to get ambushed there now. I should have maybe have just used Force March to get him into the city of uh, Nova Carfago, where we would have had more integrity. Now we have to decimate the fucking legion. Um, okay. Ooh. Oh, fuck you, lot. We've got a ramming ship there. Which, uh, let's have a look at that one. A few legions on it. They look like quite good troops. Not many, but they look alright. What do we have here? Light marines. Skirmishers. Okay, so they're attacking us from two different points, it would seem. Three different points. <laughs> okay, well we might as well then build the barricade there, but guess what? 
no option to do that! Hey. Stupid fucking game. Why they've actually decided to remove the option for some parts. I mean, why wouldn't you want to put a barricade there instead? Fucking stupid. Okay. Oh, you fucking idiot. Oh, why did I do that? <laughs> Talk about slowing ourselves down. <laughs> I am a fucking idiot. The enemy outnumbers us. I know what they do, and I've just done us absolutely no favours. Oh my god. The tower has fallen. Fire! The settlement is on fire. Which settlement? Right, move fucking fast. We got the good ones off anyhow. We're being ambushed. Why are we being ambushed? I don't get it at all. Oh, here we go. Missile units. They should die pretty soon. I would imagine. Our general is under attack. Right, okay, hold on. Alright. Oh, come on. Look at that morale. If it was any of my troops, they would have ran straight away. Right, okay, come on. Kill those levies. Oh, we're out of uh, You know what. Oh, come on! Fucking snozcumbers. Ah! <laughs> Fucking stupid this. They should die. Oh, one would imagine they would die. Let's try to take down as many of these as I can. And the thing is, these are spearmen, so they should get a few kills. Alright, oh, saying that. <laughs> we just lost a lot there. Um, so this isn't. Oh, this is pretty much over before it started. I only intended to try and kill as many as I could, but it looks like we haven't even been able to do that. I'm a fucking idiot. Well, let's end battle. Let's see how many we killed. Uh, they lost 153. I'm not sure. They lost a, a unit of cavalry. Thought they would have actually lost another infantry unit, but we'll just see what they do. I hope they don't conquer the settlement and just choose to sack it, or they might even raise it. I don't know, which isn't good at all. We killed, yeah, 153, which is probably mainly down to towers. We did see that cavalry unit off though. So hope we have some money to get reinforcements next turn. Otherwise, we are screwed, and we need to get that legion sorted in uh, southern um, Italy, so it can conquer rebellions behind us. Because the only thing stopping the mass uh, advance of a lot of these units is this legion here, which suffered a lot of losses in the last turn. What's it decided to do there? Right. Oh my god. Ooh. I'm hoping the Eastern Empire can hang on because it's by far the most prosperous of the empires. We might even. You see, the thing is, I thought uh, France and Britain would be the hardest to hold on to, but we seem to be having the, the least conflict there. Anyway guys, you'll have to find out what happens next time, so I will catch you later. <laughs>